Hello everyone, in this video I want to take a short, very quick look at the new distribution centers, underground facilities. Here we have one of them in front of us. Of course, Star Citizen is still in Alpha and has a long, long way to go. However, we are in year 12 and CRG calls this a live service game, so I think it's fine to talk about things that can get improved. We're a live service. It's most pressing to my role and my job is that we're running a live service game in the middle of our development. Okay, what is the first thing you notice? We have a distribution center. There's nothing close by. No roads, no settlements, no cities, no mining facilities, nothing. You have a distribution center in the middle of nowhere. If you put something into a game, the first thought should be, what is the purpose of the thing I put into the game? And by the way, Servers are still very laggy. It's not my PC. This looks once again 100% artificial. Why would anyone fly into a gravity well to bring cargo or to load cargo if there is no purpose? Why not just do it in space? This would be a lot more energy and time efficient. You have landing pads and you have hangers here. Those things are quite huge and as far as I can tell, all distribution centers look exactly alike. And they are just put somewhere random into a map without any purpose. Let's see if you can ask for permission to land. Are we getting a hangar? Trespassing on private property leave or risk prosecution. Okay, looks like we cannot get a hanger yet, and now our hut is totally messed up. I don't want to land just in this hanger. I will just land here, and then I will go inside and show you more. Okay, we landed. Leave area or you will be trespassing. This, of course, is only a very quick, very first look. I mean, we have now 14 minutes. There will be more. As soon as we can do more with those distribution centers. I couldn't get a hanger, so I guess this might not be in the game yet. You have machines standing around. Again, this is just feedback. I'm well aware we are in Alpha. I'm well aware this is our very first EPTU build, you have those forklifts you cannot use. Actually, you have lots of things standing around here that no one can use. You have those container cranes. You cannot even get up there. And you will notice no one is here. No one is working here. No NPCs. This feels totally lifeless. And again, I'm aware CRG will work on NPCs. I'm aware CRG has massive server issues. So it wouldn't help if CRG would put NPCs here that would just keep posing. But yeah, this looks really, really lifeless. Oh, we can go up there, I guess. We don't need an elevator for this. Yeah, this game is very jerky. It's stuttering. Not my PC. I have a very powerful PC. 7800 X3D. 64 gigabyte of DDR5 RAMs. 4090 graphic card. Yeah, this all looks cool. Looks interesting. But... No one is doing anything if you find NPCs. They are just standing there. No one is working here. It feels lifeless and yes, I'm aware CRG will work on this. But I think it's okay to give feedback. Can we go up this ladder? No. Okay. I don't see a prompt. I cannot climb up even when I jump. 
nothing happens, okay? I thought we could go up the ladder at least. Let's go down again. Yeah, and this road just <laughs> ends and there's nothing nearby. And those streets are very, very wide because our vehicles are so big. Storm tank is 7.5 meters wide. Storm tank would need three lanes in a city. Okay, NPC is just watching movies on the movie class, I guess. I don't know if this even works yet or if it's just in the game and doesn't have any function yet. By function, I mean if you can get cargo here or if you can deliver cargo to here. This looks like some kind of control, maybe door control. Yeah, nothing working here. I can click on... Okay, I can open this thing. Okay, <laughs> it's a locker. I can open the locker. And weapon rack. But I cannot take the gun. Give me the gun, come on. Yeah, no prompt to get a pistol or rifle. Yeah, and F doesn't work either. More forklifts that are, I guess, just eye candy. We cannot use them and no one is using them. Yeah, nothing I can interact with, no prompt. I hold F, nothing. More guards standing around, looking at the movie class. And more NPCs doing nothing, <laughs> just standing there. Yeah, you cannot interact with them, you cannot talk to them, nothing. Caution, let's see what we have here. Open. Container moving machine. Cannot go up this ladder. Okay, this ladder is not for humans, I guess. And those machines are not moving, we cannot use them. Here we have an area with more cargo. What is this? No idea, but of course it's just eye candy. We cannot use it. Okay, someone is typing on a dark <laughs> keyboard screen. Hey, at least someone is doing some work. <laughs> Not sure what's down there. Maybe hangars where your ship is landing. Very dark. More NPCs standing around doing nothing. What is this? Medical. Okay. Cannot click on anything. Here we have an elevator. That doesn't work. And here you have a cafeteria with pips machines that still don't work. Cannot buy anything. Okay, that's really silly. Look how much space is wasted here. You could easily have 50% more crates here and it would still be easily accessible. <laughs> CRG is really good at wasting space. We have a Cobolex machine. I don't want to see this machine ever again. We had so much trouble with Overdrive Phase 5. More NPCs just standing here. At least they are now looking different. That's nice. Okay, let's just take this hangar and land and see if we can do something. Maybe I get into trouble because this is not my hangar. And touchdown. Oh. <laughs> it has no clip. It has no floor yet. 
Okay. So, this is why I didn't get permission to land. We are now inside Hurston. Yay. <laughs> okay, let's get up again. Yeah, it's an EPDU build. It's an alpha. So I still work to do, of course. Still, it's funny. Come on, it's fine to show something funny. Yeah, <laughs> you are just clipping through. And now you can fly inside the planet. My thoughts. Yes, it's an alpha. Yes, it's the first iteration of distribution centers on an EPTU. But I make my videos to give feedback. Distribution centers all look alike. Distribution centers in the middle of nowhere, nothing nearby, no cities, no settlements, no mining sites, no roads, is just wrong. It feels like we talked about giving you distribution centers, so here you go. A distribution center with nothing nearby makes no sense, not even as a hub for cargo distribution, because we can do this in space without having to enter and leave a gravity well. Distribution centers feel lifeless, no one is doing any work, same old standing around NPCs. Yes, I'm well aware that CRG has lots of problems with servers, so until CRG can get server meshing to work, this won't change, but it's feedback. Distribution centers feel like eye candy without a soul, put into the game to give the impression of progress. This was just a quick first look at distribution centers, more to come when we can actually do something here. And of course, I'm sure I missed a lot of things. This was not a complete review. I hope you found this interesting. Let me know what you think in the comments below and see you next time. Bye. Auf Wiedersehen. And touchdown after a 5000 meter fall onto a 1G planet. <laughs> and look at this, it's rotating like crazy, it doesn't stop spinning, come on, stop spinning, <laughs> you're 12, 650 million dollars, well spent, Chris, it still doesn't stop spinning. <laughs> Come on, slow down. Any day now. And, okay, landing on its roof. Are you getting on your wheels? Okay, now it's on the side. Can I even get out? The door is on this side. Okay, anything happening? Okay, no, okay, no, it's, it's going on its wheels. Come on, a bit more. Yeah, we are perfectly fine and we can drive off. Hey, you're still here. You might want to join me on Twitter. My Twitter account is Kamoral underscore SC.